also looking at, at what's coming into us. We're conscious of how we're dealing with everything, how we're taking it in, how we're feeding it back out. We're making uh, conscious decisions on how we want to act, and then we begin to have wiser decisions. With judgments, what we're doing is we're looking at things through our filters. Like we all have filters. If I think Candy's a great person, that's the filter I, I see her through. If I think Mark is, eh, that's the filter I, I see him through. And then those filters become my beliefs. And then those beliefs, because I believe them, they become facts. So now I've started to lock you into a box. My filter puts you into a box. And then those facts affect my perception, and they become my reality. And then I'm locked in, because I've already judged you. The ego likes to have things defined. And I've already got you in that box. And that's how I see you every time you show up. If I constantly look to assess, and I constantly look to reset, and yeah, Mark might irritate me, but he's coming in. Let me, do a, let me be in the now. What is he contributing now? Forget what he did in the past. If he becomes a jerk again, if it'll, it'll show up in front of me, and I can, I can deal with it again. But he might really come in with something important. And, and Mark deserves the right to feel respected. Whether I like him or not doesn't mean I'm right. Whether I think he has value or not doesn't mean he has value or not. Of course he has value. Uh, David Hawkins talks about the fact that, you know, yeah, I, I get to be me and you get to be you because we're both made from the same thing. And of course you get to be here. And of course you get to be exactly who you are. And, and me too. So you always want to see the human in the human. You always want to be connected with that. And yeah, we're gonna have our opinions, and some people work really hard to give you the opinion that they're really wearing you out. And that's okay, you have boundaries with how, with how you deal with it. But be clear, be non-judgmental with how you deal with them. Use discrimination, use respect, because they feel it. And to the degree that you do that, everybody's gonna be looking uh, at you from the standpoint of being someone who functions at a surprising level of consciousness that is worthy of them to follow your lead.